I came to check out the waves. Wow. I could see them as I was driving, but stopping and actually going to the beach, crazy. So I'm on my way home after going to that workshop and watching Michelle fillet that salmon. I'll show you some of that today on this video. Um, wow, fall is definitely here. Talk to you later. to wanderers at dawn of the world full of war early sunrise I gave promise you said always and we run and dance I'm by your wind I'm preaching you my church I'm in and you yang you're my ease I'm your ass and no one is right or oh, this world is so blind feel no doubt sing your eyes Just right in the middle, it's still <clears throat> pretty solid. Is it normally that straight of a cut? Or? Um, yeah, so I just kind of cut down the back a little bit and cut here. And then you kind of find the, the backbone is right here. And you really just kind of keep your knife straight along the backbone. And, and cut all the way back up to here. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. it. You can walk around. Yeah, you can come around this side. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, the the mm -hmm. spine is right here. I usually do some fish when I do that's why I like the fish. You don't have to do too much. You just can them and you don't worry about them. Yeah. So what are you going to put in this I, in I just there? put like a dollop. It's like sweet, savory. So delicious. I think I'm going to cut her off here.
No, I want another, another cutting board. So, I better finish cleaning the sink that I started. Well, I guess Well, there'll be a lot to take home if you want. What are you getting out now? So I'm just trying to make like a little finger hole that I eventually <laughs> will want to use. Normally, I, I didn't start down here, which I should have, because uh, the tail's easier to hang on to to get the skin off, but I'm going to give it a shot here. So then once you get it started, you have kind of a finger hole to hang on to. And the key is to not force your knife through. You just want to gently, I'm not really putting any pressure on it. I'm just moving it back and forth. So you gotta have a sharp knife. Right? Sharp knife is absolutely key. Down here, yeah. When I'm when, when I'm done rinsing, I'm gonna keep that bucket down there long. Man, this is just the Lord and Ramsey. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's much better at it. She's not yelling enough to be Lord and Ramsey. When she yells and throws a knife in the mouth. I haven't cut gotta, myself yet, so. You gotta swear at your uh, underlings a couple times. <laughs> I didn't even know about the uh, the season uh, series. I never heard of it. Well, uh, how did you hear about it for today? Uh, I think somebody shared it on Facebook. Okay. That is the babel. <laughs> Rose hips after a good hard frost, boil them in some water, and I've just added a little bit of honey to it. It's a real good spicy. Would you take the seeds out? Would it be safer if you dried a little bit? Would you take the seeds out or just. But I. I
Hi. Guess what I got today? What? Whoa! Yes, thank you. Open them. Yes, please. Oh, I just realized there was something right there. Need help? No, I got it. Oh, it's in the boot, and it's a booster pack. That means I can finally do the trick I wanted to do. Tell me about it. Because you're opening it. About the Pokemon? Well, tell me what you have in your hand. It's a Pokemon booster pack that you you can collect Pokemon cards, and you can. There's always a code in it. So, do you collect Pokemon cards? Yep. First is. Axu, then Fletchinder, Stunfisk, Onyx, Finion, Dublade, Tyratuga, Tranquil, Sc Scrafty, or Cycle Energy, and Electric Energy. Can I see? Like, lift them up so we can see them? There you go. Pretty cool. So what are you going to do with them? I'm going to keep them. Okay. I'm going to go put them in my room. Alright. What do you say? Goodbye.